we actually have seen two deer, a whole bunch of the birds, uh, red jays as Stephanie calls them, uh, road runners, we just saw a road runner. Um, unfortunately we didn't get any of them on camera, but, but hopefully we will um, soon. We're going to head up to the top of the canyon. Our uh, propane is leaking a little bit underneath the camper, one of the connections we made. So we're going to grab some breakfast out. Nice little bonus surprise for the day. And, well, um, the best bonus surprise was we lost Eric's phone. That's true. We Spent lost my phone. a long time looking for it. Walked around for a long time. Got Stephanie up probably like two hours before she would have been getting up. I would still be asleep right now. And then turns out... It was in the bed, so that was fun. But no, we found not. it, which is really good. And now, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go on and see see what we see. And in case you've never been here, Paladora Canyon is gorgeous. Yes, we're five. This is mine. This is Stephanie's. We need y'all to help us vote which one's better. Stephanie's, mine. Okay, so here's the dealio. I'm a Bailey. She's a Bailey. So we're leaving our car truck truck at that shop because we're in Amarillo and we figured well technically we're in Canyon but we figured hey we need to have car problems and get our car fixed on vacation to be officially a Bailey so we left the car there to get a knock sensor replaced and so hopefully they'll get it all up and going they said that it should be end of day which is six o'clock for them so we've got like five hours to kill uh, yeah. so we're in an awesome town with the university and some antique shops and and some good pokey stops the pokemon that's gonna be edited out but <laughs> we're gonna have just a good time we're gonna make the best of it so here we go
we stopped for a break. And we just happened to stop where there's a lure, so all the Pokemon will come here. Oh, there's one right now! <gasps> Gotta go get it! the close encounter with the squirrel. Stephanie, could you recount the story to the camera? It's still there. I think it's scared of heights. I should save it. Breaking news. We have found a squirrel in Canyon, Texas, afraid of heights. again so that's exciting and we're gonna go down and check on the camper make sure everything's good over there and then this evening we're gonna drive around to see what animals we can see and find a sunset and a sunset right, so we are back at our campsite um, just got back a little while ago we just thought we'd set up some chairs and just sit here in the shade um, right now we're actually under cloud cover and that feels good but in the shade with the with the breeze it feels pretty good so we're just sitting here. Um, we actually just saw a roadrunner run by and, and drink out of a little uh, water right there. And, and so we're just kind of sitting, enjoying the, the nice views, the nice weather. We saw three turkeys when we pulled back up to our camp spot. We did. We saw three wild turkeys. Um, they were actually in our camp spot, campsite, and they kind of crossed the road as we as we were pulling off. And so it was my first time to see wild turkeys. They don't look anything like the turkeys you get at the grocery store. No, they aren't packaged meat. They aren't. They have feathers and everything. There's a deer. And there were two more up on the right side of the big bush. We'll see if they're still there.